This is Tom and Ben News for New Zealand's Friday the 13th special with Ben the Talking Dog and Tom the Talking Cat. Kia ora, good frightening, I mean evening, missing Auckland woman Laura Singh has been found alive in Ralsford, north of Auckland. In a statement this afternoon, police confirmed the 34-year-old was en route to Auckland where she will receive medical assistance. Her bank account had not been touched and her phone and her personal items were were left in her home. It's now day five of Mark Lundy's retrial and his brother says he told him he used prostitutes on at least four occasions before brutal killings of his wife and daughter in 2000. The youngest of the three Lundy siblings, Craig Lundy, gave evidence on the fifth day of his brother's murder retrial at the High Court in Wellington this morning. Lundy had hired a prostitute in Petoni shortly before midnight and told Craig he used prostitutes on four occasions prior. A family of cheetah cubs had their first official viewing at Christchurch's Orana Wildlife Park today. The three boys and one girl named Matata, Kanzi, Gorse and Nia have been hand-raised in a quiet vet room for three and a half months after a troublesome birth. All four cubs are now safe and healthy and took the enclosure with enthusiasm this morning, playing fighting and chasing each other through the, through the grass. New Zealand Post plan to put posties on customised mobility scooters so they can deliver both mail and parcels is angering workers who fear a de- dependent contractor model. New Zealand Post's Ashley Smelt confirmed on Thursday Standard Mail will be delivered every second day to households in urban areas starting from July in larger towns and cities. And rolling out to smaller centres over two years. A large pod. Okay, I don't know what's happening here, but a large pod of close to 200 pilot whales have stranded near Farewell Spit near Golden Bay. The Department of Conservation Staff and Projects, Jonna. Uh, volunteers are currently on the scene. The tide is due to come in around 5pm, which is not long ago, and the whales can only be refloated on a full tide. To sport now, and the Wellington Phoenix have signed former Western Sydney Wanderers wing Kwabena Apiakubi until the end of the 2015-16 A-League season. Apia Kubi has made 25 appearances for the Wanderers over three seasons at the club, but this season has appeared just twice and left the club by mutual, mutual consent at the end of January. Apia was born in New Zealand of Ghanaian parents and moved to Australia as a six-year-old. Let's get to the weather forecast for your part of the country. Traffic in Auckland and it is congested from Rosedale to South Auckland. Well, that would take you about one and a half hours to get past the city in these conditions. Gee, that's long. That's all today. Thanks for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and have a bad day. Oopsies, I mean a good day and see you next Friday, which is not the 13th.